Two French Bulldogs pictured here were stolen at gunpoint. Melissa Kim spoke to the owners just a few hours ago tonight. They are desperately pleading with those thieves to just bring them back. Take a close look at these pictures of Uno and Cartier. The owners of these French Bulldogs were too scared to be interviewed on camera, but they tell us it all happened at 11 in the morning on Sunday here on V Street Southwest while they were on a walk. Here's one of the two men they describe as young. They were in a two door black sedan and asked them about the breed of the dogs, then got out and started physically fighting with one of the victims. Then the driver comes and brandishes the gun saying, you know, give up the dog or I'll, you know, shoot you. The two men drove away with the dogs, leaving the owners terrified. Yeah, I'm very scared for my dogs right now. They've had Uno for two years and says he's had some health problems. Um, if anybody knows French Bulldogs, they are a, a special breed. They are very sensitive. They require a lot of attention and just to be cared for the right way, which I don't believe is happening right now. The owners say Uno and Cartier aren't just pets. They are our children. Those are my children. Dog owners in this southwest D.C. neighborhood share that sentiment, like Xavier Griffin. It's like someone's family and like a part of their home, so you're kind of like taking that away from them. J.C. Cherry is the owner of a French Bulldog herself and says she's going to be more alert when walking because if someone took her dog. I would literally do anything to find him. Anything. That feeling shared by Uno and Cartier's parents. Like we just want our dogs back. And they're asking anyone who knows anything at all to please contact them. No questions asked because all they really want right now is to have their family members back home with them. In Southwest, Melissa Kim, WUSA 9.